Hey, good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, and our gospel day is from Luke chapter 13, verses 31 through 35. And uh, this is a kind of a one of those passages, a little, uh, I don't know, difficult to interpret, maybe, or a little bit weird. It's an unfamiliar one. Usually, we don't hear this one proclaimed. But it's you know, the Pharisees are coming to him and saying, "Hey, you need to go because Herod is trying to kill you." And G Jesus says, you know, go and tell that fox, behold, I cast out demons, I perform healings today and tomorrow, and on third day I accomplish my purpose. Yet I must continue, and he goes on. And then, uh, and then he talks about, this is the one where he, he, he kind of talks about Jerusalem, and, and he needs to go to Jerusalem because he's going to die. It's the kind of prediction is death. But it's the first part that I liked, because obviously the Pharisees, either they're trying to warn him or they're trying to scare him off. And Jesus won't be scared of, you know, he knows what he has to do. Uh, and he wants to do it because it is right, it is just, it is a good thing to do. And I think that speaks volumes to us that, uh, you know, we have to make sure that what we do, uh, we do it because it's good, right, and just, and that we don't let our fears control us, that our fears keep us from doing what is good, right, and just. And I know sometimes it can, and it's not about necessarily a governmental thing, but you know, sometimes we, we don't want to do something that's good because we're scared of the risk to ourselves. Uh, we're scared of what other people may think. We're scared that uh, we may get lost in it. And valid fears maybe, but when they keep us from doing good, the fear has control, and that's not salvation, that's not freedom. So think about maybe today our own fears and how are our fears keeping us prisoners and keeping us from doing what is really good and just, okay? So uh, since it's Thursday, tomorrow is Nevada Day. Happy birthday, Nevada. Home means Nevada to me. I've been here around 25 years and uh, no intention of leaving because I love Nevada. So uh, home means Nevada. Enjoy tomorrow and have a good day. Bye-bye.